Yes, auction list time. Here we go. Excuse me, officer. Officer Nelson Van Pound, we got a trespass. And disregard, it's just Dan again. Hey, what's up guys? I'm Dan H and welcome to the project. I'm back here at the impound yard. I'm going to see if I could get a preview of these auction vehicles coming up. I saw the list on the police website and of course, once again, I'm bothering Officer Nielsen. He's kind enough to give me a quick uh, preview, if that's yeah. still cool. All right. Yeah, I mean, at this point you owe me two breakfasts and a lunch today because I was actually about to go head out and grab some lunch. Well, I've been eating all day. It's been eight hours. <laughs> this guy Starving. eats all the time. Every time Can't I'm here, enough. he's eating something. So, <laughs> what's, uh, let's see. I guess we'll uh, start out over here with S number one. This is a 1998 GMC pickup truck, and it looks a little burnt. All right, here we go. S1 1998 GMC pickup truck. It kind of looks like a ambulance thing but it is burnt. Uh, Officer Nilsson, do you know anything about these sheriff vehicles? As far as I know, they are decommissioned sheriff's vehicles, um, but realistically, the sheriff's department and the police department are two totally separate agencies, so we don't really know what the, you know, they got going on with their cars, just like they don't really know what's going on with ours. But what I do know is that every vehicle starts at 500, whether it's a sheriff's vehicle, bike, or, or car that we have going on. $500 for a sheriff vehicle. This guy's got a winch, so that's pretty cool. Uh, what else? I don't know. Uh, the body looks straight. It just looks a little burnt out. I don't know. Maybe some interior guys could get that going. Um, I, I guess I would ask you if you knew if it ran or drives, but probably not. Yeah, I'd probably say no. No? No on, no on the running driving, but uh, I, don't, I don't know what this is, a command post, some kind of mobile, uh, I don't know, ES, deputy sheriff's, I don't know, emergency services type vehicle, that's cool. Uh, right next to it is something very similar. Uh, next is a 1988 Chevy van pickup truck thing. This looks like an ambulance. This is actually really cool. Uh, again, 500 bucks, officer. Yep, 500 for this. Hey, look at these lights. This is probably uh, a cool vehicle. It's definitely a cool vehicle. Okay, here we go. We're getting some clues. Marine Patrol Water Rescue. I <laughs> just spray painted over it. It didn't that even de-stripe it. What's that? That definitely doesn't say sheriff. <laughs> Nobody will know. Nobody will. How will they know? How will they know? They won't know. It's all locked up. Yeah. This is cool. I want to break in. Do we know if we have keys for this thing? Uh, we have the keys, um, but just like any other vehicle out here, we don't provide buyers with keys until it's paid in full. Okay, so buyers got to pay, and then you get the keys. No, uh, no pre-starting. You can't uh, no. see if it runs. No. Nope. By uh, by as is. All right. Let's look at this thing. This is another weird sheriff vehicle. This is a 95 Chevy type van, uh, Chevy van 30, oh look at that, I wonder if this is a block warmer, plug sticking out, hey this one does have a key, oh yeah look, smart key, key, and burnt, burnt out, oh man leaving the light bars melted, look at that, sorry I gotta get rid of S1. S one's in the past. We're moving on. Oh, he's in. Hey, hey. What is this? Nice office. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> is this what you do while you're eating? <laughs> Sorry. Well, now everybody knows. <laughs> I wonder if this would make a nice little uh, little camper. That's pretty cool. All right, moving on. S4 is a porter potty. Just kidding. Sorry, terrible joke. Where's my list? Uh, 2010 Mitsubishi. So we got Mitsubishi Fuso with more blacked out deputy writings on it. I guess this is just a regular old box truck. Not even gonna bother going inside. 
because we got a lot more vehicles to look at. All right, check this out, guys. We got a whole plethora of motorcycles here. Not my thing, but it's still pretty cool. Let's go through this list. A1 2015 Kawasaki Ninja. A2 2020 Baja Platina. I don't know what that is. Weird looking. A3 is a 2003 Kawasaki ZX6R. Number four is a 2007 SSR Rascal. That's weird. Number five is a 2017 Hawk 250. <laughs> Hawk, yeah. Good one. A6 is a 2013 Suzuki GSX. A7, 2007 Suzuki SV650. A number eight is a 2005 Kawasaki Z750 S and blue. Check out A9. Got a little bit of a bump in the back. You don't really see bikes that were rear-ended. It looks like that's what happened as much. Uh, definitely a little damage on A9. And that is a 2017 Kawasaki Ninja. Officer, I could tell this one's a little bit more damaged than others. Is there a reason why you wouldn't scrap this or? Well, there, there's a few reasons. Um, you know, one of the main things to consider is with the current market, vehicles in general are very costly, even used vehicles. So used car market and especially the new new vehicles, they're a ridiculous price. So we give people a chance to still purchase something, even if it looks like it's banged up, there still might be some value in actually putting a couple bucks and fixing it up. Fair enough. That's what I'm all about. I, I appreciate you bringing in cars that are probably less desirable in a better economy because I'll buy a junk Jeep and flip it. <laughs> you know that guy's like like nothing. So, all right, I'm I'm getting it here with these uh, wrecks. All right, continuing on A10, we have a 2018 Suzuki GSX. A11 is a 2016 Kawasaki Ninja. We got A12 is a 2016 Yamaha. A13 is a 2013 Honda. A14 is a 2013 Honda. Uh, 13 and 14 are both CBRs. Don't know what that means. Not a motorcycle guy. Uh, sorry. Uh, 15. A15 15 is a 2006 Suzuki RGSX. And what the heck is this thing? This thing uh, looks like the mothership has landed. A16 is a 2003 Harley Davidson Softail. A17 is a Kawasaki something, what is it? Uh, 2010 Kawasaki KLE 650 CF. A18 is a 2017 Honda Grom. The little, little guy right there. A19 is a 2021 Hajway Gator 150. Don't know what that is. Don't even know if I'm saying it right. And A20 is a little tiny little baby honda elite uh yeah all right that's it for the bikes i apologize to all you motorcycle guys i completely just shredded probably every single name of those bikes it's not my thing i can't ride out here on long island i'd probably kill myself immediately I'd probably kill myself immediately it's just way too overpopulated. I got 1.3 million people in my county. It's just, it's not happening. So, onto the cars. The good stuff. We got A21, a 2017 Mercedes GLS 450. A22, we got a 2021 Chevy Traverse. A23, we got a Maserati. Maserati. It's a 2014 Maserati. Uh, Quattroporte? Is that how you say it? I don't know. I'm bad with things. I can't pronounce anything. It's Italian. Yeah, she's beautiful. She's Bella. A24. We got a 2017 Honda Civic. I could pronounce that one. We got a 25, a 2013 Honda Civic. A 26, a 2013 Toyota Highlander. A little banged up. A little missing some, missing some face right there. We got A27, a 2012 Nissan Maxima. A28 is a 2013 Hyundai Sonata. 
A29, 2009 Nissan Altima. A30 is a 2008 Lincoln MKZ. A31 is a 2007 Honda Pilot. A32 is a 2005 Ford 500. A33 is a 2005 Toyota Corolla. A little rusty on the roof. Uh, hey, we got a Yeep. We got ourselves an 08 Jeep Grand Cherokee for a number 34. This guy looks good. Uh, we'll try to check this out a little later. A35 is a 2010 Toyota Prius. A36 is a 2009 Toyota Camry. A37 is a 2009 Nissan Quest. That's ugly. I'm sorry. A38 is a 2007 Volkswagen Jetta. A39 is a 2010 Chevy Tahoe. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, A40 is a 2014 Ford F350. Hey, that's not a bad truck. Oh, look at this. Looks like this guy's a police vehicle. Oh, it was. It's got some stripes. Cool. A41 is a 2003 Mercedes E320. A42 is a 1994 Buick Regal. I like that. You don't see those anywhere anymore. A43 is a 2002 Toyota RAV4. A44 is a 2009 Toyota Highlander. A45 is a 2010 Mercury Mariner. A46 is a 2000 Honda Pilot. A47 is a 2009 Dodge Caliber. I like to see girls of that caliber. A48 is a 2011 Honda Civic. A49 is a 2006 Honda Civic. A50 is a 2004 Acura TSX. A51 is a 2001 Lexus IS300. A52 is a 2008 Honda Accord. A53 is a 2006 Chevy Cobalt. A54 is a 2005 Hyundai Elantra. A55 is a 2000 Mercury Sable. <laughs> Mercury Sables. Sorry, that's ugly too. Uh, A56 is a 2008 Mercury Grand Marquis. A57 is another Grand Marquis. This one's a 1999. We got A58. That's going to be an 05 Honda Odyssey. A59, another Jeep. All right, I like this one already. We got ourselves some tow hooks there. So that's cool, some nice uh, WK tow hooks. Let's do a quick little checky over here. Oh yeah, this is a 65 year anniversary Jeep. Look at that, pretty cool. This is gonna be my favorite so far. Uh, let's see, what do we got? A60 is a 2000 Toyota 4Runner. So this is pretty cool for a Toyota. Not so bad. All right, next row, A61. This is going to be a 2004 Jeep Grand Cherokee. This is onyx green, baby. Same color that the green Hornet was. Uh, that's a nice Jeep. What else? A62, going on, A62. 2003 Saturn View. Good God, that is an ugly car and an ugly color. <laughs> Moving on, A63 is going to be a 2002 Mercedes ML320. We got A64, that's a 2007 Toyota RAV4. A65 is a 2007 Honda Odyssey. A66 is going to be a 2005 BMW X5. A68 is an 08 Dodge Caliber. A69 is a 2008 Nissan Altima. A70 is a 2005 Honda Civic. A71 is a 2002 Dodge Grand Caravan. A72 is a 2023 Honda Odyssey. Wow. Uh, where did everything go? 
This does not look like it's been crashed. Uh, dead giveaway is this AC condenser, or what is this? This radiator isn't smashed at all. Looks like this thing was just stripped. Uh, you don't know if this was uh, crashed or stolen maybe? Somebody... Could have been stolen and taken for parts. Yeah. Um, you know, you can take a look inside. It looks brand new. Really? Yeah. It's, uh, jeez. Oh, it's missing a hatch and missing some interior. Um, something like this. This isn't like salvage, right? No. No? No salvage? No salvage. Man, this is actually not bad. Put all the parts back in it and you're good to go. Yeah. Wow. A 2023 Honda Odyssey, guys. This actually might be a good deal. So, uh, that's not my style, but heads up for this, guys. Uh, moving on. All right, A73. What do we got? A73 is a 2016 Maserati Ghibli. Another Maserati. Look at that. This is, uh, I guess this was white. And then they painted it or whatever. I don't know. A little, little boo-boo in the front. Uh, looks like we're on a crash row right here. Uh, A74 is a 2007 Honda Accord. A75 is a 2015 Dodge Charger. This actually doesn't look that bad either. I would fix this also. Too bad I can't test drive it. No. Next, A76 is a 2011 Mercedes GLK 350. Oh, jeez. Well, yeah, I was going to say, what's it doing in a crash row? Uh, that's missing some, <laughs> missing some stuff right there. Uh, that's been opened. Oh, well. I don't know. Maybe you guys could get it for parts. I don't know. Are these still on the road? Are they still popular? I don't know. Shout out if you have one of those. A77 is a 2005 Audi A4. A78 is a 2005 Ford Mustang. A79 is a 2012 Hyundai Elantra A80 is a 2011 Chevy Malibu. Ah, crash row. All right, A81 is a 2005 Volkswagen Beetle. We got A82 is a 2007 Pontiac Grand Prix. We got A83. That is a 2011 Hyundai Sonata. A84 is a 2005 Toyota Scion. A85 is a 2003 Jeep Liberty. That's actually not too bad. Oh, there it is. There's the damage. Ah, man. I probably wouldn't get another Liberty, but I really liked my diesel Liberty. That was actually a pretty fun car. Turbo Liberty. But this guy right here, this is where it's at. Holy smokes. This thing is huge. A86 is a 2008 Sterling dump truck. Good golly. This thing is incredible. How the heck do you guys end up with a dump truck? I have no idea. That's hilarious. <laughs> Moving on. A87 is a 2001 Ford E350 delivery van. A88 is a 2002 Nissan thing. I don't know what is it. Uh, I can't read the list and I don't know what it is off the top of my head. A88. What is this? A 2002 Nissan UD8. So UD8, guys. Get yourself a great UD8. A89. As a Mitsubishi Fuso, um, a 2010 Mitsubishi oil tanker. Look at this thing. Holy crap. This thing is the real deal. It's got buckets of yuck and everything. Oh my. Look at that. Would you look at that? Oh, it's got a locker. Eh, gross. A90 is a 2001 Dodge Ram 3500. Da, 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 da. A91, 2009 Ford F-150. A92 is a 2006 Ford F-350. A93 is an 06 Ford Expedition. 
seen better days up front ouchies and check it out we got a94 I like this flare side. We, flare side we got OBS flare side old body style this is a 1993 Ford F-150 look at this this isn't even rotten ah shit spoke too soon there's a little bit of oh this is fiberglass I think yeah I don't know definitely fixable and it looks like it's intact this is pretty cool guys this is pretty cool old school door handles look at that there is eh, a little bit of rust not as bad as you'd think for something from 1993 cool <laughs> sweet flare side all right, moving on. We got A95. A95 is going to be a 2000 Chevy Express van. We got A96. That is going to be a 2006 Jeep Commander. Almost looks like my uh, Gator, but not quite. <laughs> I'd get it for a parts car, but I already have one. <laughs> oh, man. Banged up. Airbag deployment. No bueno. 907. Yes. Look at that. 907. You must rebuild this thing and have a 907 inspection. Uh, moving on is A97. That is going to be a 2005 Nissan Sentra. We got A98. Got another Chrysler here. Chrysler Sebring of the 2004 vintage. And A99, 2006 Chevy Malibu. And A100 is a keyless Honda. What are you? Accord. An Accord, duh. Honda Accord. Oh, and there's one more. One more. Hey, jackpot. This is the bonus edition. We got A101. It's some kind of comp trailer thing. It looks like it's got wood paneling from uh, a 1970s wall as the floor. Ah. Oh wait, look at this. It looks like it was striped from the police department with uh, ATV. This is probably an ATV trailer. I will say this is an ATV trailer with a toolbox. Hey, with some crap. Jackpot. All right, guys, I've seen all 101 vehicles on this list, and I'm gonna go with my Dan H choice of the auction. Can you guys guess what I'm gonna pick? Officer Nelson, can you guess what I'm gonna pick? Get yeah, a big Sterling dump truck. <laughs> sweet. No, I'm not taking a dump truck home at this auction. <laughs> Everybody likes dumps. Everybody likes dumps. I don't want a dump truck. You know me, my wife would kill me. If I brought that thing home, you can't hide a giant orange dump truck. That is pretty sweet. I guess uh, anybody that does construction work or whatever could enjoy that. They'd be happy to have that. That's pretty cool. But I'm going to go to my pick. You want to take another guess? Yeah. This is my pick of the auction. A61. We got ourselves the Onyx Green 04 Dub J. This one has a 4.0 in it. I love the straight six. This is fantastic and even better. It's got a key. Oh, it's got no key. Oh man, thought it had a key. I was gonna see if we could go for a test drive. So, uh, I don't know, it wouldn't hurt to ask if he had a key, I guess. But anyway, these seats aren't too bad. This is the nice cloth black from the 2004s. It also has a select track transfer case. Seems to be intact. The climate control buttons aren't even punched in. This looks like it could be a good flipper. I mean, heck, it'd probably be a good driver if you get a key. Just gotta get a locksmith in. Looks like it includes some cobwebs. It's probably uh, probably been here for a little bit, I guess. Um, let's just see. Officer Nelson, if I get a locksmith here tomorrow morning, could I test drive this thing? No. And why you not? Know why? Oh. 
<laughs> yeah, not today, man. Not today. I'm starving still, so we kind of got to wrap this up. Got to wrap it up. All right. All right, so we struck out with a test drive, but I still love the WJs. I would pop in this drive shaft in like 10 minutes once, uh, you know, if I want it, God willing, and we get a key made. Uh, it's not a big deal to get a key cut for your WJs, unless you have skim, that could be a little more pricey. But in the event that this had the skim, which is security key uh, mobilizer module, I would just get myself a, a new computer for this thing and do a skim delete. I did that for my WJ at All Computer Resources, and uh, it works much better when the key doesn't, uh, or lack of key doesn't shut you off. So that's it. I love WJs. Uh, that's my pick for this auction. Don't outbid me. I uh, still have yet to win a car here. Everybody is uh, it's pretty brutal. You know, cutthroat competition. Gotta come with more money. I know, I'm just poor. That's what it is. <laughs> so, <laughs> thank you, Officer Nilsson, again for showing me these uh, auction vehicles. It's all, always fun to come out here and, uh, yeah, close this out. No more key flip. I can't get the keys and do that spectacular. Yeah, not this time. No, not this time. But uh, maybe next time we'll get something better for you. Come check out this dump truck. That is wild. And, uh, yeah, maybe I'll see you guys there. So, all right, guys, like and subscribe. Uh, thank you again. See you later, man. Yeah, comment See down you below. See you in uh, December. December? When is your next auction? December 7th. December 7th? Bring uh, a sweatshirt. Yeah. All right. Speaking of sweatshirts, do you have any merchandise for me to buy? I saw somebody uh, walking around do. with an impound shirt the last time I was here. Yeah, we do. We got t-shirts, we got hoodies, and zip-ups this time around. So, stock up for winter. Sweet. All right, guys. Catch you on the next project. Peace. Officer Nilsson said, wait under the water tower where the crows are squawking at me. He said he's got a surprise for me. What do we got, officer? The surprise is crow poop. <laughs> he's uh, back with something. I got brand new t-shirts. The simple impound logo on the front with impound on the back. All right. Pretty sweet, super soft. We got them in t-shirts, hoodies, and zip ups, all with the same front and back, so. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Dan, we love you over here. Hey. Yours. Thanks a lot, man. Right. Appreciate it, appreciate your time. Good Enjoy on, your meal. Get home safe. Thank you, you too, good night.